Greetings and welcome to Sifo. I'm Catherine of Sky, and I am very curious about this game because it looks very similar to games that we've seen in the past couple of years, Cosmeteer and um, Nimbatus, where you sort of build a spaceship bit by bit and then try to kill other spaceships. Well, this is an organic version where you have organisms that have different abilities. And you can see this one collecting all these little green things um, to start growing and adding more parts and um, and being able to swim around and do stuff. So we're going to play this game. It also reminds me a little bit of Spore, uh, which was many years ago now, um, but uh, it's kind of cool. So thank you very, very much to the developer, All Parts Connected, for sending me a a, um, a key for this game. This game will come out in mid-November. I think it's November 13th. So this is just an early preview for you. And we're going to have a giveaway because I got some extra keys. And um, so I will give those away. Look in the Discord for information about that in the announcements section of my Discord. So we're going to start a new game. And um, we have, there are different breeds of these creatures. And I played a little bit just to kind of get the gist of how the game goes and things like this. There is the Advina. This is our breed that we're going to be able to use right now. Creature not out of this world, designed to adapt and kill. Can easily change movement direction, but lacks top speed. Uses spikes and poison to deal with foes. Um, there are also other breeds. There is the... What is this one? Unknown. We've not unlocked this yet. We also have another one here, but we also, I have, um, by killing some of these things, I have collected some DNA fragments. You can see I have 14 of those. I did look for a way to reset all this, but I couldn't find it. So <laughs> we have this progress and I've killed a lot more of these. As you can see, I have 45 out of a hundred DNA uh, unlocked. So I think what we're going to do is play with Advina because we can't play with the others and we'll do the tutorial just to show you how it works and let's begin. So we are here. Move in with WASD and the mouse. You can zoom in and out with the scroll wheel. The interesting thing about this game is um, I find the movement a little bit odd so you're not like pressing w to go forward you're pressing w to go up and s to go down and you can also adjust the front of your creature um, with the mouse and it follows the mouse so this is food use it to grow it also heals so i feel tempted to like push w to go forward but that's not actually the way it works okay your current nutrition is represented by the orb at the bottom left corner so we have grow 8 of 15. there we go Click grow orb or press the spacebar to enter growth mode. Okay, so we can go into growth mode where you design the parasite. Welcome to growth mode. In growth mode, you spend nutrition to grow new parts called zooids. Each zooid has a unique function. All right. Structure zooids are used to define the shape of your sifo. Zooids can only be grown next to structure zooids. They can also slightly increase your nutrition capacity. So we need to grow a structure zooid to continue. So we'll attach it here. Okay. Um, ungrowing for when you change your mind. You can ungrow zoids by right-clicking them. This returns the nutrition cost of the zooid. You can also reposition grown zoids by clicking and dragging them. Ungrow them to continue. So we just right-click on that and it's done. Other zooids. There are other types of zooids. Movement zooids help you move. Utility ones provide helpful skills and combat ones allow you to kill other competing siphos or structures. Grow a weapon zooid to continue. Now with this particular critter, I tried out the, um, the squirter. Can spray a nasty poison that deals damage over time. But oh my god, this thing just like, it takes forever to kill anything. So the best thing is I found the spike. This zoid is a true ruffian, always looking for a fight. If your enemies touch the spikes, they decay and become delicious food for all to enjoy. Yes. So this thing works um, even if you don't actually pierce stuff. You can actually run into them with the spikes or kind of whirl around and that works too. All right. You can see your energy and available skills in the lower right corner. That's these guys over here. You constantly generate energy over time. All skills use some energy when activated. Um, using skills, smash, smash EMI. The letter next to the skill represents the key that activates. So we have mouse one and mouse two. That's left and right click. 
Uh, you can view more information on each skill by hovering your cursor above the skill. You can activate them when you're not in growth mode. Okay, go. Activate skill to continue. So we have a dash and then we have pierce. I want to move the dash to um, the second button. Later we'll move it to a key. Like uh, it also adds Q and E. Once you once you get more skills, this menu sort of grows uh, all on its own. So it just it it equips all the skills that you are having. Um, so if we chose to have this utility, we've got the squirter. We'll go ahead and attach this also to the front of our uh, well ish front there. Um, then it adds another one, as you can see here. Uh, emit your mu movement fluid. Enemy slow you down. We're going to put that on the mouse too. I don't know what this thing imaging is. Is that, is that middle click? I have no idea. Oh no, it's Q. It's actually Q. Right. So Q is going to dash uh, for us. I wonder if I should... Ch I wish I could change that to E or something. Oh. Oh, you can change it. How excellent. Um... I think we'll change it to... Yeah, Q is actually fine. All right, we'll, we'll just use that. <laughs> That's what I use in WoW for my, my dash thing. All right, now we have a capacity of 19, um, and we'll go. Let's go ahead and go. So this is what I find kind of odd. So I, I would want to press W to go forward, but, but you can't. You just have to go this way. This is especially confusing when you have the, the, um, the movement zoids attached Okay, use your combo zoids to destroy this egg obstacle. Okay, so we can try our poison thing. If we go, we'll just aim it there. Skill manipulation. You can reposition the skills in sky, inside the skill bar in growth mode. We just did that. You're going to rebind them to a new key. I love this. I love this nice quality of life feature. Thank you, devs, for adding that. Several skills may be activated with the same key, which is quite nice. Okay. But remember, they all... Uh, need energy to grow. Okay, so it looks like this is not doing anything or not much anyway. Is it actually doing anything? Seems to be adding cracks on the top there. But notice how our energy bar is used when we're using this thing. So we're just going to use our piercing thingamajingy and get some green stuff. Okay, cool. Uh, the poison is more useful on these kind of guys, like this guy. Ah, we poisoned him. Okay. Let's see if we can catch him. Okay. Oh dear. Let's go and poison. There he goes. All right. And he gave us some stuff. Let's get this thing. Get that food. Okay. More food. All right. You progress through the game by diving through whirlpools. Deeper waters have more difficult challenges. Right. So we'll go down here and go into the whirlpool. There we go. Okay, the Azure Depths, we are here. Um, we can go and chase these guys down. There's some here, there's one there. Now the best part though to, okay, yeah, now we're, we're not, we're dashing a little bit. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, we've poisoned him a little bit. I don't know if he's gonna heal though, that, that he might. Uh, and we might also want to think about getting some other stuffs. Because we have lots of things here. Let's poison the heck out of him. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I've been eaten. No, I've died. Okay, so I, what I should have done is actually go and a attach more zooids to me. All right, let's go again and be a little bit more cautious. <laughs> it's funny when you're playing on YouTube because... Things don't always go the way you want them. I actually got quite far um, in my test uh, game. But first of all, there is already a dangerous little guy over here. So let's go ahead and um, make our creature. Now, we could get a um, one of the speed things, which I think might actually be a very good idea. Let's get, get one of these guys, put it on the tail end here. And we'll put a couple of spikes on the front. We can definitely afford them. This will give us two spiky things to uh, kill stuff with. I'm thinking the poison thing is not that great. It doesn't really kill stuff very fast. So let's go ahead and get this guy. Oh gosh, whoops. Ah, I forgot to adjust my buttons. <laughs> there we go. Let's put them the other way around, shall we? There we go. Oh, no, it's running away. No.
the best thing, uh, of course, on these guys is to um, collect the the part that is the heart of the creature. That's the way we're going to get the most. Come on, come on, speed, speed, boost. There we go. Uh, and then we can, of course, get the other pieces later. Um, but we get the DNA fragments, which is really nice, so that later we can uh, unlock these other critters. Oh. Okay, let's go ahead and um, improve our um, our creature a little bit. I think... I think yeah, I want another spike, maybe. Could be there. Yeah, that's fine. It'll be a little bit lopsided for now. Uh, but that's okay. There we go. Wow. Got the heart of the creature. Really did well at uh, getting those things. All right. Now, here's where the weirdness in the movement comes in. Is that uh, you kind of fishtail around sometimes with this thing. If you don't face forward. Oh, go and kill it. Come on. There we go. Okay, and we got all of the bits and pieces. Let's go ahead and get another spike. There we go. Put it there. Uh, and then later we might even get more uh, movement thingy. But having more spikes is always better, I think. In this kind of a situation. There we go. Hitting that core is, is like the best thing you can do. There we go. Nice. Okay, and we got, wow, tons of DNA. So uh, I don't think there are any other creatures around here. Once these whirlpools start to appear, uh, you don't get any more um, free food. <laughs> oh, there's some free food actually right over there. One of these. Um... Oh, but we can't fit. Oh, no. All right, we're going to leave it then. Okay, so if, if you're pointed at another direction, sometimes the movement is kind of weird, I have to say. It's just very odd. Um, but that's okay. We'll... We'll try to get the hang of it. But I would prefer that, like, W would go um, forward, perhaps. Oh, wow. Look, we got the Guardian of the Depths. We have to kill that thing somehow. <clears throat> yes. <laughs> I don't know how this is going to happen. But we're going to do our best. And hopefully do well. All right. We're going to use... Oh, boy. Okay. Hold on. No, no, no. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. See if we can delete one of those spikes. Okay, there we go. Wow, we did well there. Okay, we got a little bit of growth thingies, which is good. Wanted to aim for the center of him. Come on, come on. There we go. From the core center, there we go. Deleted this guy, even though he was huge. Much bigger than we were, but we got him. Got some DNA from this. Got food, growth things. Um, I wonder if we should get some... Another movement thingy majingy. I'm kind of tempted. Let's just take off the spikes for now. And maybe put in a couple of structure things. Like one there and one here. And then put our movement guys there. And then add some spikes. So we'll have like several forward spikes. Well, we could even do this. We could be like pinpointed on, on a certain area. Or we could um, move them this way to have like more of a, th a pronged triton style attack there. Um, what else do we have? Oh, we have an energy leech. This creature saps the energy of nearby creatures while energizing its own colony. Now, I've tried this thing in my test game, and it was not that not that great, I don't think. I wonder if we should go for this uh, pronged attack like this. If I do this, then the next one would fit here. So it would go outward a little bit. 
uh, or we could just try this way. Let's try it this way and see how that works. I'm putting these um, engines, I keep thinking of them as engines, but they are radials. Um, they, they power us to go forward just to offset this because I've noticed that if I have a very top heavy organism, then it's much harder to control this. So let's try to go in here, let's dive for it. And oh, actually I should have tested out our movement speed. Oh, wow. Wow, that was really nice. Really good design there. I think we are very maneuverable. The one, another cool thing that I like about this game is, and they mentioned this on the Steam page, that there's no backtracking. You don't have to go back to any particular area uh, or find stuff or waste time um, that way. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. These are poison stuff. No, go away, go away. Oopsies. No, 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 no. I really want to kill this thing. Just kill it. Thank you. All right, let's go up and get this energy glob thing. Get some food and stuff. Whoa. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. That was very owie. But we are repairing ourselves, which is really good. Uh, I think I would like to add some more spikes, though. Uh, or we could even add a squirter here somewhere. What if we add this one that way and add the squirter this way? No. Or we could do something like, let's just take that off. Add the squirter in the middle, you know? Let's see, that's dash poison we want with mouse one so that we do all of them at the same time. That seems okay to me. Let's see how this works out. Let's see if we try four spikes and then one squirter and see how that works. I have no idea. I'm just, we're just having fun and trying to figure what we can do here with this. Wow, this is really cool. So if we do this, the poison does squirt out the front. Okay, that's looking really good. Oh, there's one over there. Let's go and get this guy. Okay. I guess we'll just have to watch our energy uh, so that we don't use too much per, per thingy-majingy. Wow. Can we just... Can I run into this with the spike? Yes, I can. I don't even have to use energy to collect those bits and pieces. Oh, look at this. They're having a fight to the death. I don't know if the squirter is that effective, to be honest, but... Come on. Ooh. I wonder if the squirter is really not worth it because I feel like it's using a lot of energy and it really doesn't hit, especially since we are moving a lot of the time. So that is not actually very, very ideal. Can we move this? No. Let's go this way. I want to go and chase down that other critter that went down here. Ooh, we have whirlpools. Okay. Looks like we're kind of done. Uh, let's dive then. Oops. Go. Let's see where we are next. Sprangled greens. Okay. I think I want to... Hmm. Energy leech. Maybe we should try an energy leech instead. Maybe we'll add this thing instead. Um, kind of want more spiky bits. Can add one there maybe. Or even on the back. No, no. Let's do this. Well, okay. We can only do one side. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Mass two, drag ten. Okay. Hopefully we won't get too... Um, we're not too... Uh, asymmetrical for this. It should be fine, I think. I'm kind of getting used to the movement here. It's a little bit funky. I like all these branches. I really like this zone. It feels quite cool. Uh, okay, this is a place that has no particular uh, end point. Ooh, we got some of these creatures out here. Alright, 
keep on going. Definitely want to deal with these creatures. That thing is funny, that energy leech thing. I wonder if it actually is doing anything. I have no idea. Okay, let's go down here. Pick up this thing. Come on, can I have this? It's weird that I'm not able to kind of... Okay, there we go. Then we picked it up. Are we just injured? Is that why we're not growing? Okay, I think so. This thing, I don't know. I'm not impressed with this at all. I think we're just going to go with uh, spikes. Let's put this one, this side one in the center instead. Okay, let's go this way. See if we can catch these things. This is kind of a fun... Let's get this food. Okay, that increased our health with this thing. Wow, okay. Oh, those things have spiky bits on them. Okay. We got the DNA. That's the important bit. Good. Okay, let's see what else we can find to kill. These things don't seem to be destructible. They just uh, are obstacles. Let's see what else we can look at. Oh, there's a an enemy. Ooh, there's some stuff. Some chromosomes floating around. Excellent. Okay, I got that thing, whatever it is. Oh, it's energy. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Let's pick up this stuff. This is weird to me, though. Um, that this little thing, it's harder to pick it up. Okay, let's go there. And we got this one. Give me DNA. I'm going to try to go in sideways and <laughs> collect these things. No, 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 no. Up here. There we go. Scuttling along the sides. Ah, there's another creature there. Let's go ahead and grow um, and figure out what else we want to do here. I wonder if we should move this stuff up somehow. If we get a structure here and then move this guy like this. Possibly adding spikes here too. I don't know if this is going to be very effective, but we can certainly try it. I think it's worth moving that one here, though, too. And uh, hopefully that's going to work. Let's see. Uh, all right, let's go spacebar. Wow, this is really, really something else, that's for sure. Let's go see how this performs. Are those, um, nope, nope, those are poison. Those are poison. Okay, there we are. We, uh, we decimated it. Okay, cool. We'll pick up all the little bits and pieces. We still have some grow things on us, which is nice. Come on, there we go. We have eight grow pieces. Um... 11 to get the next spike. Wow. Interesting. Okay, there's another creature stuck over here. Hey. It's not your lucky day, dude. Wow. Area clear. I've never noticed that. Does it always say that? Probably. Let's just try to get out. Oh no, we're stuck. All right guess it's time to lighten up a bit. Let's take off these things and get out of here. No, 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 no. There. There we go. Go backward. Okay. Oh boy. Okay. So let's go ahead and recreate that. Um, get these uh, thingy-majingies going. 
combat. Uh, spiky, spiky, and whoopsies. There we are. There. Oh, I thought we had 11, and now it... Oh, I wonder if they were injured or something and it gave us less back. No, that's unfortunate because we had enough to buy another spike. Okay. So here's a whirlpool where we can go in. Oh, these are getting very big, very big and scary. Let's dive. Here we go. The Queen's Hive. Oh. What are we going to face over here? That is scared. Oi. There's like some... Okay, we can't go that way, I think. <laughs> I think it's like, no, no, that's a current. You're not allowed. Ooh. Okay, that looks kind of dangerous. I wonder if that's going to shoot stuff at us, probably. Okay, I'm just going to kind of gently approach. Oh, wow. Lots and lots of bomb things over here. That's definitely not ideal. want to stay away from those. Wow. I'm just like... We have no energy. <laughs> I think we took it out, though. We must have. Because it doesn't seem to be regrowing. What is this thing? Oh, no! Okay. Hello? Okay, let's go and get the rest of this first. All the good DNA stuff. All the grow stuff. It's kind of funky when you lose parts, and we might have done so there just briefly... Um, what do I do with this? Zooid added turbine. Ooh. Okay. A meaty mover. It propels you sideways in two directions. Sideways in two directions. At once. That sounds interesting. I don't know what that means exactly. <laughs> that sounds very peculiar. All right, let's go and, um, this is Earthy Blossoms. Let's go and see what we're going to go hunt. Okay, we've got the DNA from that one. I'm just going to wait for that to explode, then go grab the DNA. There we go. Ooh, well then. really pay attention and figure out what is the center of that organism. Okay, let's go down this way, maybe. Oh. Wow, that hurts. Hurts, no, ow, ow, ow. Spike, spike, spike. Go, go, go. Kill it. Kill all the things. Okay. Okay, we did get another grow thing. Ooh, I don't know if we've killed one of these before. Wow. It's like an electroshock thing that it does. I think. Looks like it anyway. Okay, we have 14 of 18. Um, kind of wondering if we should just extend our structure a little bit here. We have a turbine, costs five. How does this work? Let's just try it. I'm not sure. I'm pressing up left. I'm not sure that this works the way I think it. I want it to work. <laughs> okay. Um, 
I think we we need to get a little bit more uh, nutrition, and that would entail getting a few more of these um, uh, things. Though this kind of really works well the way we have it. Um, we could just add another xenoplate like here, maybe. Oopsies. Maybe here. And here. Because that will give us more space for energy stuff. Uh, and add another radial. Maybe there. And more spikes. We really need more spikes. Ooh, we can't afford more spikes now. Darn it. Okay. Go like this way, maybe. Can I can I have that please? Thank you. Nope. Alright. It's gotta be head on, looks like it. Well there. Oh, it can go there. Okay, so it can go between these little spikes as well. That's quite nice. Alright. Uh and that's it. Oh, darn it. We need eleven for another spike. Not sure if that was a, a good trade, to be honest. Nope. Want to get away from those. Stay away. They're going to attack each other. Yep, I don't mind picking up the pieces. It's fine with me. There we go. Getting all the stuff now. Come on, give it. Give it. Now this is something that I think could use improvement. Getting like these little pieces. Surely this is not meant to be hard like this. I feel like we should have a little bit better if any part of our body touches it, then we should be able to collect it. I think we want to go and add another spike. Okay, so keep on going. Oh, here we go. Let's try out the weapons. Wow. Just kill all the things, will ya? Nice. I can just plow over it that way. Oh, 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 oh. Go away, go away, go away. I forgot that that was like a bomb thing, a little mine. Okay, where we've got another one. Okay, there we are. This is actually quite a maneuverable um, thing imaging. Feels like it, anyway. I'm really anxious to collect enough DNA to try out another species of... Uh, of creature because I want to see what other variations and weapons and stuff that you can have or food acquirement technologies or whatever you want to call them. There's something down here we can get. There we go. Just kill the whole thing. Oh dear. Whoa, 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 whoa. Poison, no. Come on, give it. There we go. Nice. Alright, I think I want to add another radial out here. Just for a little bit more speed. Ooh, there's a thing over there. Let's see if we can get around this rock here to go chase it. Ooh, a whirlpool. That's interesting. I guess we can dive. Let's go see. Okay. Wow. Casal. Oh dear. Is it like brain worms or something? Yuck. Are those hitting stuff? Like, are they hitting the other pieces? Hmm. No, no, I really want that thing. What is it? Hmm. Can we 
move down here. <laughs> Sideways if need be. Oh, this is just an area where we can kill stuff. Okay. I thought it was going to be like a boss area. But I'm now feeling like this design may not be working as well as I want if those uh, side things don't quite... Oh no, I'm stunned. I can't attack. There we go. Got the center of it. So these are the creatures I've killed the least of. I only have whatever five DNA or something for them. Hmm. Let's go collect these bits. We certainly could use them. Okay, let's go and see what we can do here. You know what? Let me get out of this particular area. There we go. So we can design a little bit better. So these things are actually hitting these. And that does not help us at all. Um, kind of wondering if maybe we should just take these off. 10 nutrition. We could, we could add a structure here. Which would allow us to add these guys in. Perhaps like that. How does that work actually? Okay, those just hit each other. Okay, this is really quite interesting because games don't usually do this. They don't usually limit you that way. Um, so this is kind of funky, interesting. So this does not work there. This one would work better there, perhaps. What about that? These go further. Okay. So I think we'll do that instead. Get that one off, go this way and this away. Like that. Okay. Um, we just go a little bit different orientation. I'm like having trouble concentrating on my little grid here. Um, all right. So, but we could add some kind of, we could get a squirter. I mean, in reality. If we really wanted to. I'm not sure if we should though. I really don't know what the best design is. Because I feel like we're a little bit limited with these spikies going kind of every which way. Uh, we could make it wider. You know and add another spike here. Like this. That's another option for sure. Uh, or we could possibly add a squirter. To just... Um... Do this and just add one here like that and make sure that the poison is also key one mouse one and that might be okay and that would poison whatever we're next to since we're we're doing mostly this close range combat anyway oh wow we already finished this area Okay, that's interesting. Ah, but we're not done yet. Whoops, I'm clenched here. Whoops. Okay, so they're using the those thruster things. Those I forgot what they're called already. But um, to kind of spin, I think. I think that's the idea. Wow. Spin. Energy. Energy. Help. All right. Area cleared. Boom. Nice. We really did not get much from that at all. And I think that's probably... Um, let's see. Just because of how we were doing stuff. Okay, so this, we have an added thingy-majingy. We could move this one off to there. And then move... Add this possibly there, and add that. Have that going this way. Or even straight on. But we do need... We could use another squirter here. 
Or we could do the energy leech. I really don't know if this is very useful at all. I'm not quite sure. One energy regenerated per second. So this one actually has better energy regenerated per second. I wonder if there's a way we can check that. 24 energy per second. Okay. Okay, let's try this. I don't know if poison stacks either. So that may be completely useless to have two poison things. So that generates two poisony bits. Oh, we have to go. Okay, never mind. We can't test. The pass of Maj Majatha? Majatha. All right. Let's try this. Don't know how it's going to go. Wow, the background is so cool looking. I like this. The colors are amazing. All right. We have some stuff. Okay, there we go. Be scared. Be very scared. All right. Nice. Thanks. Okay, we poisoned this thing a little bit. No, 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 no. It's eating the side of me. It's gripping me. Come on, come on. Kick it. Come on, energy. Go, go, go. Please, please. Wow, okay. Whoo! Right. Okay, thank goodness I added some poison stuff. But man, this is very bad. This is really, really bad. Okay, we are missing these things. This Zoid was destroyed and we'll use nutrition to regrow automatically, but we have no nutrition going on at all. Okay, we're just going to keep on spraying poison at this thing. Wait. A little bit of uh, energy. Oh boy. This is not a fun time here. This is very scary to me. We're getting killed by this thing. I feel like I should have spikes all over me instead and just completely redo my... Wow, no. Ow, ow, ow. We're going to die with this one. We're absolutely going to die. No. Ah. This is bad. This is like, I'm, I'm dead. I'm totally dead. Can I just... I can't even really do much with this, can I? I can possibly do a spike, one spike here at the front, and that's it. Like, really? Aha! We're doing our best. Well then, this is a valiant fight. Oh boy. Haha. <laughs> yeah. Not good. Not good. Oh dear. No. I can't I can't even do anything cuz I'm like lightninged over here. Oh. No. No. Oh no. Oh dear. No, no. This is not good at all. This is this is this is the end. This is the end of the microbe. <laughs> We're going to die. Yep, it's killing me. I can't do anything. I can't even move. Oh no! Well then, nutrition collected, 120. Zoids killed, 241. 1488 lifetime, and final score is 4138. I have no idea what these numbers mean, like the score and stuff like that, but we got to be an accurate guppy. All right, I think that's pretty good for uh, episode one. I'm going to probably play a little bit in between so we can unlock at least one more of these guys. This is 69 out of 100. This one is 90. So if I play like one more game, I should be able to unlock the next breed. So anyway, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time. And remember to check the Discord for the key giveaway. Ta-ta!